guys, welcome to this video tutorial here. Today I'm going to show you how to set up command blocks for PvP. So here's a command block here. We're going to open up this command block and we're going to do slash scoreboard objectives add and then we're going to call the pain, uh, we're going to call this kills and then we're going to do player kill count and we're going to call it kills again so let me kind of explain the the script here so scoreboard is what we're going to use to keep score uh, and then objectives is what we're going to use to show that we're going to use an objective called kills and uh, player kill count okay so the next blocks here we're going to go ahead and open up this one we're going to do uh, slash and we're going to do scoreboard here again um, and then objectives and this one we're going to do set display sidebar kills so that that way on the right hand side of the screen there's going to be a little indicator that's going to show us our kills hit done we're going to go to the next command block right here we're going to click on this one and this one we're going to do slash scoreboard objectives set display list kills so you know when you push the tab key on your keyboard it shows you who is online well this will also show you how many kills they have there as well so I'm going to hit done and we're going to do slash scoreboard objectives set display below name so here this one uh, and then kills this one here is going to put your kills below your username so we're going to come back here, we're going to click this first uh, switch. We're going to click the next one. You can see in my chat down to the left here, everything that happens when I click these buttons. We're going to click this one here. This one is, and we have our last one here as well. And as you can see next to my name, I have zero. And you can see on the right hand side of the screen, it also says that there are zero kills. So I'm going to have um, someone log in here for me. Fiery Mage has joined the game. And let's go kill him and see what happens. There he is. Okay. See, below his name, you can see it says zero kills. That's kind of awesome. Now, if I kill him, you'll see that I have. On the right hand side of the screen I have one kill and if I push the tab key you can see I have one kill up there as well now he can come and kill me and you can see after he kills me because he doesn't have any weapons it's gonna take him forever but um, once he does kill me you will see that he will then have one kill as well pretty easy to do especially for any PvP matches I want to show you a quick little thing that you can do also on, on here. Let's go ahead and edit this block. And instead of player kill count, we're going to do total kill count. And what total kill count will do is allow you to keep track of anything that you kill, whether it be a player or an enemy. And it will keep track of your kills there. So let's clear out the kills. We're going to do scoreboard, objectives, remove, kills. And I want to reassign the kills with the new objective that I put in there. So we're going to go ahead and do every single one of these again. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my game mode back into creative so I can get myself a sword and... Um, something that I can spawn. Let's spawn some zombies. Grab a sword so it's easy to kill them. Let's grab these zombies here. 
And then let's try killing them, and my score should go up here. Okay, I should have three or four kills now. Three. This should probably... It says I have zero. Hmm. Let's go check this uh, command block and see what happened. Okay, let's click on this command block here. Oh, it didn't take it. So let's back this out here. Uh, so let's change player kill count. Let's um, let's go back in here. Oh, I see. I wasn't I wasn't in the right mode. So I was I was in um, I was not in creative mode when I did this. So that's why I didn't take it. So you have to be in creative mode in order to do it. So now the total kill count. That's all set properly. Now I can add that to my list. Click all these other buttons here. And you will see that the kills will go up as I kill the enemies. I hope you guys like this tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, or anything like that, please leave them down below. It's been a pleasure, and thanks for watching.